Hey everyone and welcome to my weekly Facebook update. I'm actually recording this on Wednesday as I will be attending the County Executives of America Conference in Washington, D.C. on Thursday and Friday this week. I started this week by issuing a proclamation recognizing November as National Family Caregivers Month in Knox County at the Alzheimer's Tennessee headquarters. As I told folks that day, I have a personal story about the sacrifices that family caregivers make. My grandmother suffered from Alzheimer's and my aunt was her primary caregiver. While Alzheimer's robbed grandma of her memories and eventually her life itself, it also robbed my aunt of some of her best and most productive years as she spent them caring for grandma. Thanks to Alzheimer's Tennessee for all the work that they do in addressing this disease and for the support they give everyone who is affected by it. Issued another proclamation recognizing Mr. Cecil Campbell on his 100th birthday. Mr. Campbell is a veteran of the United States Army Air Corps. For those of you who don't know, that's the Air Force before it was the Air Force. And he's a very prominent member of the Fountain City community. Congratulations again, Mr. Campbell. This week I hosted my first regional mayor's luncheon. I think it's very important for our area that all of us work together, and I look forward to seeing my counterparts in other East Tennessee counties on a regular basis so that we can discuss the successes, issues, and challenges that all of us are facing. I filmed a fun interview on Trolley Talking for the Knoxville Weekend website. The segment will also be aired on Fox 43, and we'll be sure to let you know when that happens. I spoke in a morning Bible study group hosted by my friend Joe Johnson about the opioid and drug addiction problem here in East Tennessee. As I have said so many times, this is not a problem that government can deal with on its own. It takes the entire community, and I'm very thankful that the faith-based community is being activated. This week featured my first community constituent meeting. These monthly meetings will give folks a chance to talk with me one-on-one, -on -one, and I'm really excited to get started. The inaugural meeting was at the Powell Branch Library. I was ecstatic at the turnout, which is well over 50 people. Most of the folks there wanted to talk about the Hallsdale Powell Utility District. It would take me quite a few weekly updates to talk about HPUD. At the meeting last night, I suggested that we have another community meeting in January that would include HPUD executives. We are in the process of organizing that, and as soon as I have more details, my office will let everyone know. So thanks for watching, and I hope you all have a wonderful weekend.